catch them all Alright guys, I'm taking a look at a battery charger and I really like the options this affords me because typically if I wanted to charge say a AA I'd have this, if I wanted to charge 18650 I'd have this, and of course this is only two bays. This charger that I'm looking at today is a four bay and I can charge either, you know, one simultaneously. So included with this is a little carrying pouch, a little VIP sort of a thank you type card and a little user manual so you have a little information. Now the cool thing about this is instead of being a typical just plug it into your wall type of a uh, power you have USB power and it's plugged in so I can't show you that but it's just a little USB uh, micro USB which is already plugged in here and plugged up to my little uh, power bank over here. Uh, so you can do wall charger or power bank whatever you need to do to be able to charge you have that versatility which is really really nice and this is the actual unit itself now I don't know how well the display is going to show up for you but hopefully you'll be able to see this but you can see each one of the batteries are detected and each one is charging I can see the charging status um, I have overcharge protection uh, there's you know built-in protections for the unit itself as far as short circuit uh, you know, things of that nature, so you don't have to worry about the safety aspect as much. And of course, it's just a simple spring loaded functionality there. Uh, with this display here, uh, this one has an A and a C. I don't know how well you can see that, but hopefully, you can see the markings there. And if I wanted to change, uh, for some batteries, you know, the slower, the faster you charge a battery, the more, you know, stress you're putting on the battery. So the better off it would be uh, as far as a slower charge, typically. And with this, I can actually dial in the amperage from point, I think it's 0.5 and 1.0 and 2.0. So yeah, depending upon which one you want to do for the better battery health, you can actually do so and it's very easy. I don't know if you'll be able to see this changing or not, but let me see if I can turn this light away. And maybe you'll be able to see it better. So hopefully you can see right there. So I can dial in the actual uh, charging amperage that I want which is kind of a cool option, you know, uh, intelligent in that regard. Now, if I press the C button here, you'll see the display change, and it's, you know, so you can see the different batteries. So you can see the battery type, uh, the voltage, you can see the charging, uh, you know, progress. You'll know when it's finished. So it's, you know, the voltage. You have a lot of different information available to you. Um, so this one. I have a little bit of a vision issue, so I just wanted to make sure and double check so that I'm telling you properly. So hopefully you'll be able to see. And you can see right there, the battery type actually is changing as far as you know what type it's being detected. So I wanted to share that note. I want to double check my notes because I want to make sure I give you some accuracy here. So, dun, 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 dun. so voltage, current, charge time, battery type, internal resistance, battery capacity, uh, overcharge protection, short circuit, over discharge, over current, two year warranty. I mean, there's a lot included, very intelligent, but a very compact design. So it's basically the size of these two, but it's all in one unit. I don't have to worry about plugging it in, finding an outlet. Um, I could plug it into a power bank, um, you know, so, you know, something that's very handy. I uh, have a little charger over here it's plugged into. So just a super convenient aspect, and I like that you can dial in the amperage for the better battery life. So that's a pretty cool aspect. So I wanted to share that with you. Um, I have a few different chargers, and this is just a pretty convenient, you know, aspect to have because 
most of my other chargers, they do have to be plugged into the wall. So I like when you have the option to plug it in. So you pretty much want a 5 volt, 2 amp uh, power source. Pretty typical to find those these days. And because of the intelligent aspect, of course, it's going to charge the battery at the ideal uh, setup except for the fact that you can dial in the amperage. So you can choose for your own, you know, some people like to be very proactive, I think, with their batteries. I'm very careful about my cell phone in that regard as far as battery health. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. I think it's really cool. Uh, this is just a double A and a 18650, which are like two of the most common. Now there is a huge range. You can actually see on the back it lists a large number of different compatible types so it does have quite a bit uh, you know some little cooling and everything I guess cooling vents right here it doesn't seem to really get very warm I suppose if you loaded it up uh, full with four batteries all the time uh, and you're in a hot environment maybe you would notice but I haven't noticed any kind of uh, issues with it so I think it's going to relatively stay cool all the time uh, but yeah I just wanted to share that with you really quickly I'll leave a link below so you can find out the entire list of different batteries that are supported because it is, let's say, it's quite a lot. But typically, I just use double A's and 18650s, and that's it. So I don't have a huge need for the other battery types, but I love that it includes all of those because there are a few others that I have here and there. So, anyway, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to give you a quick rundown and overview of the functionality and everything. But, uh, you know, it's pretty easy to read. If it wasn't for my vision where I can't read small writing very well, um, I think it's pretty easy. I can read most of it, but I wanted to be able to read the very, the, you know, the smallest part right there, which is the 1.5, uh, the 1, and the 2 amp, just to make sure and confirm uh, what I was seeing there. So, anyway, that's what I wanted to share with you. Again, check out the link below. You can find out more. This company sells a multitude of battery chargers. I have a few from this company. Um, this is just happens to be my favorite of, you know, of the ones I have currently. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Hopefully you find that useful, kind of gives you an idea of what to expect with using this. And you can see that there's a broad compatibility and simultaneous two different battery types, which typically for me, I just have in the charges I've ever had in the past, it's always been one type or the other, not a combination of different ones. Okay, so that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.